What's up YouTube, it's ZapdosTCG here and yes, I'm back with another video, it's been quite a while, way too long actually and I was really busy, sorry for that guys, but I'm still not dead, I'm still uploading videos, so uh, I have another Wi-Fi battle against Cassidy, she brings her Manectric, Gardevoir, Umbreon, Aerodactyl, Lapras and Mega Kangaskhan, I know it got banned on the Smogon side, but you don't have to comment in the comment sections like oh Mega Kangaskhan and stuff like that because uh, yeah I already mentioned here I don't really care about Mega Kangaskhan it's one of the best Megas but yeah it can be countered as you can see in this video I'll be showing you that so I have bring a Mega Agron, Talonflame, Iggy Slash, Garchomp, uh, Alakazam and Crawdon. Crawdon actually is uh, new <laughs> to the competitive scene because he has the adaptability and it can knock off some stuff like items and uh, yeah with the stab adaptability is really crazy so Kangaskhan is on the field and I'm bringing heavy metal my own Agron, one of my main leads because I really like Agron uh, because it has so much bulk, it has the defense through the roof, one of the best out there and then uh, special defense is not as good but uh, through his uh, ability that actually uh, counter super effective moves is really crazy and uh, deals uh, less damage and I uh, yeah we both mega evolve straight from the bat and uh, I'll be going for a thunder wave that's the main thing I always do but yeah, she uses Fake Out, which means uh, I won't be uh, dealing the first uh, attack because I'll be flinched. As you can see here, I couldn't move. And uh, now uh, he, the Gangaskhan is going for a Power Up Punch and it hits twice because of his ability. Uh, the baby uh, hits as well, the Mini Gangaskhan. And uh, Power Up Punch actually uh, roses the attack or raises the attack from Gangaskhan twice because it hits twice. And now I'm using Thunder Wave. Gangaskhan is paralyzed, which is great, obviously, because uh, he won't be as fast as he uh, was in the past and he'll be able to be paralyzed uh, once in a while and that'll be great because I'm sending out Aegislash, my Z-Zord, as you see I'm a fan of Dragon Ball Z and I predicted the power-up switch, uh, power-up punch and now I'm using Sword Zen. So uh, at that time I didn't know that uh, the Kangaskhan also uh, ran uh, Shadow Claw, but you'll see that uh, he's going to use that uh, now after I use two Swords Dances. So uh, if I can manage to hit it with sword uh, Sacred Sword and knock out this Mega Kangaskhan, the main threat of his or her team is actually gone. So I'm using King Shield, predicting something like uh, Sucker Punch or stuff, stuff like that. And as you see, yeah, Sucker Punch, she has Sucker Punch, Shadow Claw, uh, Fake Out and then uh, Power Up Punch. And now I'm going for a Sacred Sword, hoping he, uh, she'll be paralyzed or uh, using the wrong move like Shadow Claw instead of uh, uh, Sucker Punch. Yeah, and it actually worked out, she was paralyzed and I can knock it out. So the main threat is gone, Mega Kangaskhan, out of the picture, out of the field, out of everywhere, yeah. Next up is Manectric. I thought that the Manectric was her uh, Mega Pokemon, but <laughs> yeah, she had a uh, Mega Kangaskhan. So it's the regular Manectric, I don't think it's that good. Uh, Shadow Sneak kills it in one blow because I've, uh, yeah, my uh, attack has uh, been boosted by Sword Zances. Now Aerodactyl comes on the field. It's like a, a mini Aegislash sweep. Actually, Aegislash is uh, the best, one of the best Pokemon from uh, the last generation. Actually, uh, we have Aegislash, Talonflame, and then uh, another couple of good Pokemon in this new generation. Next is Umbreon. And uh, I wasn't fast enough, I thought my Aegislash uh, was faster than Umbreon, but uh, yeah, that's not true, so I'll be, uh, I was going to be knocked out by Shadow Ball, unfortunately, because I thought this would be an Aegislash sweep, that would have been a nice video. Huh. Anyway, Heavy Metal is back, a Shadow Ball, uh, I think I'm gonna eat it up, because Umbreon is a defensive type of Pokemon, I'm Thunder Waving the hell out of it, and uh, yeah, I'll be Thunder, uh, I'll be Paralyzed as well, because of his Synchronation, or uh, yeah, Synchronize ability, so I'm paralyzed as well. Didn't know that. I thought that it was another ability, but yeah, don't really matter because uh, yeah, we're both paralyzed. So that's ironic. I paralyzed the Umbreon to get both paralyzed in one uh, turn, so that turn did nothing. Now I'm getting out the rocks out here. Stealth Rock on Agron is so good because no one can one hit KO uh, Mega Agron instead of maybe a Talon Flame. Nah, not even that. Agron is uh, Mega Agron is such a beast. Anyway, the, uh, the Rocky Helmet hurts me, but I'm using a uh, Dragon Tail because I want to paralyze all of his Pokemons, and uh, hopefully I can paralyze his uh, Lapras as well. Uh, that's the thing I want to do with Mega Agron, Thunder Wave, and then Dragon Tail around all his team, or uh, to uh, actually. Uh, put paralysis on uh, all his Pokemon, but yeah, 
I'm paralyzed, I'm paralyzed as well, so yeah, I die. The surf and the ice beam was too much for uh, Mega Aggron to handle. Even a critical hit didn't really matter right there. So, what else do we have? My Psycho, my Alakazam, which is uh, has the ability that he is not hurt by weather effects, by Life Orb, which is the item he carries. And uh, Surf actually doesn't deal that much damage because uh, Alakazam does have a decent amount of special defense, but his defense really sucks if you hit it with a physical attack, he uh, drops right there. <laughs> so, Focus Blast and he's out of there, the Lapras. Next we have uh, Gardevoir. Uh, yeah, I'm just going to use Shadow Ball Healer because uh, he's not as mega, so he's not going to turn into Fairy type, and it's super effective, and it'll be knocked out in one blow. So it's actually a really easy match, and it'll be a short video, but I'll be bringing more videos soon. And uh, I actually built an entire box of uh, really sweet Pokemon to use in different teams. So there we have it. So Focus Blast finishing off this Umbreon. Bam! He's out of there. So it's really easy when all the Pokemon are paralyzed, even though Alakazam has crazy uh, an amount of speed. So we and that was the battle. Actually, I uh, really liked her team, but uh, the Mega Kangaskhan really as our main Pokemon. The rest didn't really do that much because uh, yeah, I uh, got some paralysis out there with Mega Agron. I really suggest you guys check out Mega Agron. It's really been underestimated. Also, Talonflame is one of the most used Pokemon. It's also in my team. Didn't really have the time uh, to shine in this video. Also Crawdon, but I'll be bringing a new uh, Wi-Fi battle soon. And uh, yeah, about the trading card game. Hopefully I'll come back in the trading card game. I uh, stopped for a while because uh, yeah, I was so busy with exams and stuff. But hopefully yeah, you guys, true subscribers, are still out there. And uh, yeah, also I'm... Uh, Thinking about making another song because my EV song got so many likes and uh, views that I uh, think about making another uh, track like that. So uh, let you, you guys know what you think. Put it in the comment section and uh, let me know what uh, your team is actually for uh, the Wi-Fi uh, circumstances and X and Y. And also Pokemon Bank is still not available in some countries, only in Asia and stuff like that. So that's not really fair. I'm thinking about making a song about that, but not really sure. Uh, anyway, thanks for watching and uh, please leave a like uh, so I can uh, actually make the motivation to make more videos and I'll see you guys soon. Thanks for watching. Yo!